Opportunity Enterprises has been the ninth largest employer in Porter County for a number of years now. Uh, we have about 420 staff members. It's, on, it's an $8 million payroll. It's a $15 million year company. Um, those payroll dollars are being spent right here in our community as is the, the dollars that the clients are making. Um, in my mind, it's a, it's a huge impact to uh, uh, the quality of life uh, for everybody here in, in, in Porter County. The point of OE is to provide three basic services to a challenge individual. Transportation, we move them around all day long. Residential services, uh, we have group homes, apartments, and what we call day services. And day services are what's going on now today at uh, 2801 Evans and other lakeside facility. We have contracts with a number of companies, uh, typically uh, hand manipulated packaging, uh, rework, and this is piece count typically that a client uh, can do uh, sitting at a table during a work day. Uh, they get paid per pieces. Um, but they also have enrichment. Uh, and enrichment could be uh, CI, community integration. Uh, this is where a client says, uh, you know, the community's doing so much for me, I want to give back and do something for the community. And they may go to Tall Tree and pull weeds. They may go to some of our customers and pick up already shredded paper. The other enrichment is uh, assistive technology. Uh, this is computer work. Uh, here we have some clients that may just be learning how to count money. Certainly learning how to uh, email, uh, search their favorite NASCAR driver or their country western singer. And the thing is that we teach them those things uh, in our facility with our instructors and then they can go home and enrich their own lives and maybe even show their own parents, this is how you do this. Uh, so uh, uh, it's really neat stuff and of course lastly would be our uh, art department. And our art department is making great pieces of, of canvas art, uh, ceramics, and most recently we got a glass kiln. So we're looking for exotic bottles making glass pieces. Um, and every one of those art pieces has a client name attached to it. Uh, they get uh, paid. It's a wage earning proposition for a client and for us. Um, it's, it's a very neat situation. And that's, uh, that's day services and the, the real bang in my mind for the community's buck, if you will. Their parent, uh, mom, dad, caregiver, brother, sister, is able to go off and do a job like you and me and also earn money. Otherwise, they may be home watching over their, their challenged son or daughter. And in this case, uh, we do it, we do it well. I think we do it as efficiently as, as anybody could ask for. And there's also the social aspect of it too. They have, they have girlfriends, boyfriends, just like we want to have. Uh, they have great fun and we, do, you know, we have client dances. Um, there certainly is a social aspect to it that if they were not coming into our services or some service provider, uh, they would be very lonely people at home. Going forward, the newest thing uh, that has just popped on the radar screen is our job source division. And Kathy Savage and her team uh, is doing a tremendous job there. We have just opened up a LaPorte County office. Um, and again, it's all about getting individuals back in the workforce. Um, and uh, that is certainly the, one of the big things on our radar screen. Our lakeside is also huge. Uh, we're investing almost $4 million out there into a new day services building. We have 13,000 square feet out there now. We're building another around 26,000 square foot building, uh, which will be two levels with the walkout lower level to the lake. Uh, we're building the first of our apartment buildings. Those are eight three bedroom apartments. Uh, we have a floating fishing piers out there. Uh, last summer we had two boats out on the water. Uh, we've got a, a, a great uh, shelter that Rotary helped us put up, a 30 foot by 60 foot shelter. It, it's a great environment and it will be a, a, a great location for uh, challenge individuals from uh, certainly throughout the region. I think if, if more people would, would get engaged with Opportunity Enterprises or a like service provider and realize uh, a little more about 
about that population, they would be happier individuals themselves.